Well, for your outdoor edge tip of the week, we are gonna show you how to put a coyote on the stretcher. This is a beautiful coyote you shot last night, huh? Yes, sir. And I see you got most of the face paint off for school. Yes. I heard you squalling this morning. Did mom have to scrub you pretty hard? Yes. <laughs> All right, well, we need to put this coyote on reverse because when they come finished up, they'll look like these coyotes, all nice and dried out. And that's how you sell them at the fur buyer. So what you need to do now is turn this one inside out. Okay, buddy? All right. There you go. I know it. He's been sitting outside. There you go. You can probably grab him right there and flip him. Nice. There he is right there. Where's the snout? There you go. Pull him all the way out. And there's the head. Nice job. So now you can see we've got a little bit of fleshing to do. So we're going to take a little bit of this meat off this hide. Well, we'll pretend this is all fleshed out. Trent has his uh, outdoor edge knife here. And what you can see, I'm barely angling the knife so we can get some of that meat off there. Right, Trent? Yes, sir. And that's what we're going to end up doing is fleshing this out all the way without cutting him, right? Yes, sir. All right. So first, we're going to go ahead and show people how to put him on the stretcher. All right, you remember how? Yeah. All right, here's the stretcher right here, and I'm going to pinch it for you. Okay, there you go. Good job. And then these need to hook onto the feet. That's right. So when you put them on the stretcher, biggest thing is to make sure you're even, right? Yep. So we want to make sure that that coyote pelt is nice and even. Good job. Now you know what to do next, right? Yep. Where is he? Okay, if you want, you can put one here on the tail and pull him down hard that side. And then you can take this one and we can hook those little forks up there. There you go. That's it. And then here, and we'd even that up and pull it down hard, right? Yep. And then you'd want to turn these feet all the way, right? Yep. So I'm going to put my finger in there and I'm going to turn those legs nope. all the way out. And then we just make sure he was even. So your outdoor edge tip of the week is how to put that coyote that Trent shot last night on a stretcher just like that. Now you want to make sure it's fleshed out first, and then after leaving it on the stretcher for, depending on the humidity level in the area you're at, you might want to leave it on there a couple days to even a week until it's not tacky to the touch. And then you're going to take and carefully turn it around to where it's first side out, and you'll put, put it back on the stretcher until it's dry. Right? Yes, sir. Nice job. That's your Outdoor Edge Tip of the Week.